Hey guys, we're playing Outlast today. Yep. It's a YouTube staple. I guess. I see a lot of people playing it. Yeah. Say it's really scary. So, uh, I we guess... We'll see how scary it is. Well, it has a nightmare and insane mode, so I guess it's gonna be pretty scary. I guess. Yeah, that that's a good part. <laughs> Contains intense violence, gore, graphic sexual content, and strong language. Please enjoy. So you're miles up, sir, blah, 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 investigative reporter, blah, 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 ambition to look, earn him an intimate tour of hell on earth. Always willing to risk digging into stories, no other journalist, blah, 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 blah. Dark secret <laughs> at the heart of Mount Massive Asylum. I guess it's a massive asylum. Stay Mount alive, Massive. Stay alive as long <laughs> as you can. Record everything. You're not a fighter. To so navigate the horrors of Mount Massive is supposed to truth. Your only choice is to run, hide, or die. Okay. Not a fighter. Not a fighter. That's important for a true horror game. I hate, I hate survival games. I love and hate them. Well, I mean, if you if you're powerful, then it it makes it way less scary. I wonder if it, it's even possible to do a truly scary game where you are powerful. Like, yeah, I don't know. Like Bloodborne is scary, but you're the most powerful thing in it. Yeah, but I still find it scary. <laughs> I'm still scared. It takes it all away from me. I don't feel scared at all. I feel like the creatures in that game should be afraid of me. Yeah, I guess so. Uh, I don't like those scary radio noises. Is there a lot going on like right now? Like, I'm yeah. hearing a lot of noise. Oh yeah, it's just noisy. It's noisy in general. They throw in a lot of scary noises at you all at once. Did the radio say anything important? You know what? I think it's just about general scary stuff happening. It's like general scary things are happening. Yeah, it didn't say anything to super set important. the mood for the game. Exactly. September seventeenth, twenty. You don't know me. Ridiculously annoying email address to me. <laughs> Illegal activity at Murkoff Psychiatric Systems. You don't know me. I had to make this quick. Murkoff. Monitoring. Two weeks software console at Murkoff. Blah 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 blah. All sorts of NDAs, and I'm very much breaking right now. Seriously, fuck those guys. Fuck those guys. Terrible things happening there. Don't understand it. Don't believe it. Doctor's talking about dream therapy going too deep. Finding something <laughs> that I've been waiting for them in the mountain. People are being hurt. Murkoff is making money. It needs to be exposed. Okay. A little inception. Going on. Oh, so they sent that to this journalist. Yeah. And we're like, coming. And he's like, doop to doop. I'm not gonna get hurt. Come journalize. Okay, that all makes sense. So what are you supposed to get on tape? And is there a point system? <laughs> a point system, no. <laughs> For what you record? I, no, I don't think so. I think you just have to find out what kind of scary stuff is going on. Okay. What kind of scary things are happening. There's some classified stuff. There's a witch with a mustache. That's so scary. Ah. No, turn the game off. Ah. <laughs> um, nothing, nothing here. What's the <gasps> license? No. Automatic gate. Um, locked in. <laughs> What's his license plate? Oh, it's not personalized. No. <laughs> it's got a nice looking Jeep though. I like to add in my own grunts. Yeah. Makes the game more real for me. I always, well, my friends always used to do that when we would play Nintendo when we were kids. Um, so, I mean, I guess I already know, I've already played the first ten minutes of this like a million times trying to get the capture right, so I'm just gonna, I'm not even gonna pretend that this is brand new, I'm just gonna go to where I know to go. Yeah, no, no need to pretend. <laughs> no need. To... Oops, oops, oops. There we go. But this is all gonna... just teaching you how to control. I'm gonna splash in this fountain, though. Hooray. Hooray. It's all just teaching you how to control a character anyway. Yeah. Not the worst tutorial I've ever seen. I only went up to a certain point. Uh... Did you get spooked? 
There's one part that did make me jump. I'll see if it makes you jump too. Oh, the little rattle thing happened. That means uh, something mysterious happened. That doesn't mean anything. Little saw action. Saw noise action. Mysterious oh. happenings. Yeah, it was... F your night vision camera. I don't need it. I have complete memory of how this room was laid out. So, what are those? Bullet holes? Bullet hole? Oh! Should you yeah. record that? No. You don't need to record anything. Are you doing actual journalism? No! I'm just being an idiot and running around this super dangerous asylum. Yeah, but if you were a journalist, you would want to record the mess and the bullet holes. I mean, I guess. And the blood, right? Yeah, well, I guess so, but like... If you're going to journalize it. But I don't really know, if, is that what the game's about? I mean, I'll just waste... I need my... See, the thing is I... Let's go back this way. The thing is I need my camera and my night vision on the camera to help me get around. So I don't actually want to use my camera because my camera runs out of batteries. Okay... So you're not a journalist? I am a journalist, but for but for the uh This is not Pokemon Snap. Like I'm not <laughs> trying to get pictures of everything. I'm trying to just survive. I think the figure guy, out what I'm doing in the game. The kid in Pokemon Snap would be a better journalist than this guy. Yeah, maybe. Because he actually takes pictures. <laughs> you know what? I just <laughs> I'm, well, conserving, that open now? I'm conserving my resources. I found like scary stuff, but I haven't actually found anything to accuse anyone. Once I can jacuse someone, then, then I'll take some video. And then there's this. Looks like a piece of intestine, you said. A little piece of intestine. Before. But you're supposed to wash your hands. Better wash your hands. I better wash my hands. Okay. Those Pepsi machines that aren't actually Pepsi machines. Cola, drink it. It was, uh, that, that was, that's really well done. Drink it. They use the same colors and everything. They did. To get you to think what they want you to. Uh, spider, get out of there. Spider Slayer. Spider Slayer. Spooky see office? Anything. Spooky office. You. Oh. oh. What did he do? He came into that room I was just in and panicked and ran out. Okay. So it sounds like the journalist is... What's his name? Uh... <laughs> Mike? Something Upser. 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 Upsher. 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 Rupture. Rup Rupture. He sounds so scared. Why don't he just go home? I know, exactly. Turn right around, go home, call the police. That's all you need to do. Yeah. Be like, I broke in here. Okay, whatever. I'm a journalist. Look at my badge. What does that say? I mean, he's not willing to actually record anything, right? So right. just go home. So is it all jump scares? So at this, uh, I don't know. So at this point, you'd be thinking, just go home. Do oop, oop, oop. How do I, how do I, how do I? Night vision? How do I night vision? Well, you keep pressing. That's how do really... I, okay. Scary things are happening. Let me night vision But we first. can't see them. <laughs> so... <laughs> me too. I can't... Ah, there we go. There we right. go. Okay. There we go. I like so... I fell down. Okay. Yeah. I'd be going... I'd just go home. Gonna boop you. I would've gone home boop. a long time ago. Some light reading. Okay. A bunch, a bunch of heads. A bunch of heads. There's a guy in Oh. Hey, buddy. They killed us. You're not dead. They got out. The variants. You the can't fight them. You have to hide. Okay. You can unlock the main doors for security control. You have to get the fuck out of this terrible place. How's he talking? He's planning on it. Well, he's still alive. He only just got piped. But you know, don't help him or anything. Oh look, it's like torsos. Torsos and, and wow, this is 
Yeah, man. This is pretty gory. This is pretty gory. We're gonna have to put a little bit of a maybe an age restriction on this. Because I mean, we I just we done. played what Mario Kart Eight the other yeah oh oh, oh. <laughs> our other video. So this is only as far as I played in the last one. And this is only as far as you're going to play this time, because it's time for the next episode. Okay. <laughs> like, don't help that guy or anything, whatever. Yeah. Just let him... I mean, it's probably better that he does have pikes to let him, because it would stop the bleeding, and maybe if it went through his lung, it would kind of... I feel whatever. like he shouldn't have been able to speak. I'm already not... I'm, pick, I'm being too picky. I don't feel good about this main character. I think he's kind of a jerk. I think he's looking out for himself. <laughs> okay. He needs to calm down. Some respiratory problems. Can you give him a break? No. Can he's... you go buy him a pop? No. Ooh, yeah, good idea. He sounds like next... he could use a drink. Next pop machine, I see. Next time. Okay, see you guys next time. <laughs>